Hey everybody, it's Haley with Haley with a Flare. Today we're gonna fly Air France on their 777-300 in Economy. Let's check it out. If you are new here, don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. So I'm going to be up front. This was probably the worst overall economy seating I've ever sat in going across the pond. This is a quick peek at what business class looks like. This is what premium looked like. We were sitting in a regular economy because we did get a deal, so I can't entirely complain. We flew for almost free because my Chase Sapphire card had a 25% transfer bonus to Air France. So anytime you can get to Europe is a win. But if I had paid full price for these seats, I would not have been happy. They are super narrow, super close together. Although there are a lot of great new features on this, you'll kind of just see the pitch width is very short. My daughter is 5'2 and a half. I'm 5'3. My husband is about 6'1. And there is not a lot of room back here. Now, some of the perks of what I did like is the cup holder right here so that you don't have to have your whole tray down. Another thing that I also really enjoyed is that these were bifold trays because if this was not the case, myself being plus size would not have been able to fully extend a normal tray in these seats. I'll give you an idea of what the normal tray looks like because even my daughter, who like I said is five, two and a half, maybe 120 pounds, very athletic build. This is very close to her coming out as well. Now, there are a couple pockets down here. This is great. We were able to shove, you know, my daughter's iPad, some headphones in here. Overall, the in-flight entertainment was pretty good. I wish there was a little bit more variety in movies. Not necessarily variety, but choice. It seemed a little limited, but these screens were beautiful. The touch screen was very, very responsive. Would highly recommend checking this out when you're on your flight. I'm going to kind of show you what the movies look like here in just a moment but overall very very happy um, with some of the gaming and movie options as well let's click on film so you guys can see what this looks like all right so there are obviously some films in french in here but obviously a good amount of english as well enjoyed watching a couple movies and playing games i actually played more games on this flight than i normally would this is the pillow you are given. There is a small blanket, but this plane was so hot. I definitely didn't use it. These are the headphones my daughter is wearing. They click in right here. These are the games that they had. I played a little Sudoku, a little Solitaire, and a little Monopoly. This is the intro video when you're getting ready for takeoff. It was very cute. Really enjoyed that. And then right after takeoff, they dimmed the lights. I thought this was so cute that it looked like the French flag in the cabin. Then it was dinner service. Now, this was really, really slow on our flight. And they were already out of some varieties by the time they got to us. But this is what the chicken meal looked like. Olivia got the pasta. One thing that is nice about Air France is they do include a little cheese and really great butter with your meal. Didn't sleep much on this flight, but then it was time for breakfast. And I will say the breakfast felt a little disappointing because everything was so cold. Even the roll that we got with breakfast was very hard and cold. But um, it was kind of a decent variety. I just wish, you know, there was something a little warmer. I know on Delta, even in economy, you kind of get like a little warm egg and cheese sandwich or something of that nature. But everything was just extremely hard and cold. You do get a little yogurt drink that comes with this. There's a couple different spreads. So overall, if you're going to fly Air France, this is definitely not the plane that I would fly. I'm going to be posting another review of a different plane that was a little bit more comfortable. So I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you on the next one.